Hi, this is Carl Smith for Universality, and the question of the week is, what are you, you doing for your sweetie on Valentine's Day? Nothing. He'll be in Edmonton. Actually, she's doing something for me. She's taking me out for dinner. I haven't decided yet. What are you doing for your sweetie on Valentine's Day? Very little and very cheap also. <laughs> he's my sweetie, so he's supposed to tell okay, me. Okay, just a second here. Can we uh, focus over here? What are you doing for your sweetie on Valentine's Day? Same as her. <laughs> Nothing. Nothing at all? I won't even be here. Aren't you going to use your imagination and think of, of, of just a little something? Oh, you see, I'm a very busy student. Yeah. So you're going to do homework with your sweetie? Oh, maybe not. Nothing. You must be doing something with your sweetie. No, I'm not. Is he going to be doing anything for you? He better be doing something for me. <laughs> Sending him a card. Is that all? Yeah. Is he going to be doing anything for you? I hope so. I'm not quite sure yet. I don't have one at the <laughs> present time. What are you doing for your sweetie on Valentine's Day? Oh, I don't have a sweetie. You don't? Are you going to be searching for a sweetie on Valentine's Day? Uh, not really, no. Uh, well, I don't have a sweetie. What would you do if you did have a sweetie? If I had a sweetie, um, I'm not sure. Probably something nice. <laughs> he would do something nice. <laughs> what I do? You uh, got one? Uh, no, not at the moment. That's, well, that's maybe what I should do for Valentine's is get one. You think I could do that? Do you think you could do that? Uh, what would you do if, if you did have a sweetie? Uh, probably take her out for dinner. How does that sound? Sounds uh, real romantic. I don't have one. What would you do if you did have a sweetie? Um, I'd do something really special for him. Uh, would you like to elaborate on that? Um, I'd go out for dinner. I'd take him out for dinner. Have I got a good deal? Do you want to go out for supper on Valentine's Day? <laughs> You're kidding. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't know. I, it's just a, it's a really special day, so I'd do something really unique. I'm going to send her a bunch of beautiful flowers. Anything else? And give her all my gold. And give her all his gold. That sounds really nice. My sweetie on Valentine's Day. Yeah. I hadn't actually thought of it. What are you thinking of doing? <laughs> well, a box of chocolates and a bouquet of roses. Anything else? No, that'll be enough, I think. For my Don't sweetie? <laughs> it's personal. <laughs> Would you uh, care to elaborate on that just a little bit more, please? <laughs> Sounds interesting. Um, <laughs> yeah, use your imagination. <laughs> Shall I tell a wonderful lie? Sure. <laughs> yeah, I'll be looking for one. <laughs> what would you uh, be doing uh, for your sweetie if you found him just before Valentine's Day? Well, hopefully he'll be wealthy, so I'd probably ask him for a substantial amount of money. Uh, we got a little bet going. If, I, if she wins, I have to take her up skiing for three days, and if I win, we're going to be installing my new speakers. Um, I don't have a sweetie. Uh, what would you do if you did have a sweetie? If I had a sweetie, uh... <laughs> Use your imagination here. Uh, well, it's working overtime, that's why I can't think of an answer. Uh, if I had a sweetie on Valentine's Day, I'd, uh, I'd, uh, I'm sorry, I can't. It's, uh, it's one of those seven words you cannot say on television. <laughs> what are you going to be doing for your sweetie on Valentine's Day? Oh, all sorts of things to make her try and feel special and buy her flowers and stuff. And if that doesn't work, get her really, really drunk. Buying chocolates for him. No, a stuffed animal, chocolates, and a dinner for two at a very romantic place. Uh, any uh, idea what that romantic place might be? Lakai? No, oh, I think I'm going to take him to my place and cook him a really nice dinner. That sounds great. You're going to invite me? <laughs> no. <laughs> what are you going to be doing for your sweetie on Valentine's Day? I don't know. I forgot. <laughs> what are you going to be doing for your sweetie on Valentine's Day? Going to Romeo and Juliet. <laughs> what am I doing for my sweetie on Valentine's Day? Well, first of all, we're waking up in the morning and we're flying to Petty for breakfast, and then it's off to Acapulco for a little swim in the ocean. And then after that, you know, we're not really sure. We might go shopping in New York, of course, but that all depends on how much money I have left. Uh, well, I've got two, so I've got this extra large jar of Mazzola, and we're really going to have a great time. <laughs> Are you going to be inviting me uh, to this as well? <laughs> well, if you bring your own, I don't think we'll have enough for three. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> it seems like everyone's got fun things to do on Valentine's Day. This is Carl Smith for Question of the Week. One more, one more,